Welcome to an early July edition of uh, Cooking at LRC's Kitchen. What's on uh, the menu for the day is two different dishes that I'm making with snake gourd. I've taken a long snake gourd and about three-fourths of it has been cut into pieces over here. I'm taking about a glass of milk, a small glass of milk. Uh, I would have about three or four chopped green chilies, salt to taste and curry leaves. A crucial addition to this would be one teaspoon of rice flour. Begin with the bagar. Some udadda, some chanada, jeera. Some mustard, some terry powder. I told you about four green chilies slit long, few curry leaves. Now put in the cut snake go. Salt to taste. The snake goat has a bit of uh, water in it, so you don't have to add any water to the vegetable. Ensure that this is on a low flame. Close it so that the generated steam will help the cooking of the snake goat. After about 5 minutes, uh, you will see that this is the consistency of the uh, cooked snake goat. Now what I will do is, I will take a glass of milk, as I said, and about a heaped teaspoon of rice flour, gently add it to this milk, and Stir it in a manner to ensure that there are no lumps of the flour in the milk and the milk is the rice flour is completely dissolved in the milk. Now add the milk into this mixture. Mix it. for a while. The idea of the cooking now is that the half cooked uh, snake goat gets completely cooked and it learns to live alongside the new addition of milk and rice flour. Once again, close it. I saw that it required a little more milk so I've used another half a glass of milk into this because the whole idea is that the end the product must be a little liquidish so now you can look at the consistency of the product uh, it will have to be a little loose and not uh, a crisp uh, dish so i've added a little more milk than the one cup that i had said so it should be about one and a half and then let it cook for about a minute or two the second uh, dish that I will be presenting today is a raita that I am making with boiled snake goat. Uh, my daughter Meda loves it. Uh, the ingredients are very simple. You need some boiled snake goat. From that long snake goat that I had, I just took one fourth piece of it and boiled it in water. I have not added salt to it. Uh, the other requirements would be some grated coconut. 
a bit of powdered mustard, some putnalu, some salt, uh, green chili paste, curry leaves and coriander leaves. What I will do is take coconut, less than half a coconut for that amount of uh, snake goat boiled. One teaspoon of mustard seeds powder. Two spoons of putmalu, they are heat, salt to taste. I have coarsely ground uh, green chilies. I'll put that also in the mixture, a part of it. Now what I'm going to do is bring this mix to a nice steady mixture with a little bit of curd in it. Ensure that when you're doing it, there's a nice sting that comes out of the mustard powder. I will add a little more uh, curd. To get the sting which is not yet there. I will also add a little bit of water. Yes, it smells of mustard. Now into the heated oil, come cumin seeds, some mustard, and even as it is splattering, I beat the cuts of its thick consistency and get it to a raita consistency. Now I will add the remaining uh, two uh, pieces of two green chilies that were coarsely ground. The oil is well heated. Now I will put the curry leaves into it. The cut coriander goes into this. This mixture goes into it. Now into this mixture add the pre-boiled Made gold and add the tarka. The raita is ready. The presentation is ready. Remember, uh, for the raita, I used the Telugu word putnalu. It's roasted chickpea in English. You have the snake goad milk, snake goad curry, and you have the raita made with snake goad. Thank you. Do send in your comments. Acknowledge the presence, contributions of Dattu and Ritika to the activity this far and Abhinav later for the editing. Goodbye. Remember I had added a bit of salt to the mixture there but the uh, curd content and the boiled uh, snake goat did not have any salt in it so add some salt to taste which should be very little. The snake goat writer is ready.